Different in Jesus Christ in today's gospel, or today, the church celebrates the feast of St. Matthew, uh, the apostle and evangelist. So Matthew himself writes uh, or relates the conversation. Uh, so he was sitting in a house, uh, like a tax booth, and then Jesus invited him to follow him. So he, he, in a way, you know, like... Uh, he was ready to repent himself and come back to Jesus Christ. So that, uh, for expressing his gratitude, so he gave a banquet to the publicans and sinners. So in which the many sinners were invited and others also were invited. And then the, uh, the, the Pharisees began to ask questions uh, uh, about Jesus. You know, why was the master is sitting with the sinners and tax collectors, you know? So that's how you know that uh, life begins. So there is a joy, there is a joy in St. Matthew because he has left the job, might be he was not happy, he was not happy in doing those jobs, you know, collecting the taxes, more tax, taxes from the people, he was not happy. Could be, could be, because of which, you know, Jesus had called him to follow him. So, you know, you can analyze in that way also, dear friends. So, he was called, though he was a sinner, but he was called and chosen as an apostle and evangelist. He began to write about Jesus Christ, write about Jesus Christ and about himself, his con conversion. So therefore, dear friends, we also need to write something about Jesus Christ in our day-to-day -day life. You know, the wonders that he is performing in our day-to-day -day life or in somebody's life uh, or in somebody, somebody else's life. So looking at that, you know, we need to write it down. Because if you don't write it down, then the future generation may not know what had happened. So because, you know, there is, a, 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 if you go for studying history, so we... The history has been written down about kings, about war, about economics, about uh, uh, life of the people, tribals and so on. So the history has been written down so that we take it and read what had happened 3000 years back and 4000 years back and before BC and, and so on. We come to know about it. Medieval period, ancient period and then contemporary period, modern period. So we come to know because they have had written it down the historians had written it down because of which we come to know about it so therefore dear friends we if we want to make known christ to others we also need to write it down the graces the blessings that we receive each and every day and also the the, the blessings that we see from others so in that sense we also can proclaim the word of god to others as matthew did because he wrote long back about Jesus Christ, but now you are reading, the, the Bible is there in your hand, you can buy the Bible and then read it out, uh, what Matthew has written, what had happened, how Jesus lived, so you come to know and you you grow in faith, you go, grow in faith, so therefore, let us write it down and others may read it and they may come to have faith in Jesus Christ or those who have faith in Jesus Christ may grow more in faith in Jesus Christ. Thank you.